No one can remember a monotone. And when we read in a monotone, we're basically asking our brains to retain the single most boring, difficult to retain <laughs> type of thing in the world. And so you can make it a lot easier to retain by like giving the words that music in the read stage. But then when you translate after you read, you say what you just read back to yourself without looking at it in your own words. And then this allows you to actually process that information enough that it can be yours. You know, you've put it through your own filter, um, not to get rid of information, but to make it your own. And then it stays much better. And then the last stage of the process is the quip. So after you put the information in your own words, you say something about it to yourself. Just, And it could even be just a laugh it could be a snarky joke. It could be an example. It could be, oh, that reminds me of that time or, oh, come on. It, it doesn't have to be some kind of your know, groundbreaking thesis, but it gets you in that habit of responding and creating a conversation with everything you read. And the idea that like neurons that fire together wire together, that when you recruit other parts of your brain into the action, it's just going to stay without you having to brute force memorize it.